Welcome back to T-Mobile Park. I am here with FAMU outfielder Ty Jackson, who scored the first run in Swingman Classic history. Ty, how does it feel? I mean, it feels amazing. You know, it's truly an honor to be the first run ever. So, you know, it's a blessing. All right. Do you have any more in you? Uh, you know, I mean, I, I can see if our team can stack up some more runs and, you know, maybe I'll be a couple more. So, you know, we might run away with it. So. And this is your first time playing in an MLB ballpark. What are the vibes like? Uh, the vibes are immaculate. I didn't expect this many people to be here, first off. And second off, this Seattle's beautiful. And even if it rains, they have a dome. So, you know, it's just a lifetime experience. And Florida A&M has a huge fan base. Shout out to the 2023 SWAC baseball champions. Uh -huh. What do you want to say to the family right now? Uh, I love you, family. Thank you for always being there, supporting us. And you guys are one of a kind. I love you guys. Beautiful night here in Seattle. Let's go down to Simone Stanley. What do you have, Simone? Thanks, guys. Three of these players were able to participate in the MLB Draft Combine just a few weeks ago. Highland Hall, an outfielder out of Bethune-Cookman University. Trey Page, an infielder out of Delaware State University, who actually had our first hit of the game tonight. And a right-handed pitcher out of North Carolina A&T, Xavier Meacham, who has so far stolen the show on the mound here tonight with two strikeouts. Last year, two HBCU players were drafted into the MLB. Let's see if we can get those numbers up. Indeed. Thank you so much, Simone.